Access Wrestling fan, Bill Saunders here, and I'm here with Joel Gertner. What's up, Bill? How are you? Oh, I'm great. I just want to let you know, my generation, ECW fans, you were our hero. You're the best mouthpiece around, and I actually feel like you were the one who started the whole heel mouthpiece to get pops out of the crowds. Uh, has anyone ever said that to you? Uh, I, I hear I hear things like that, and I'm always flattered when people think that I'm an original or that I innovated a certain type of style or trend. It, it always makes me feel really good that I left a lasting impression, yeah. I always felt you were a huge part of ECW, and uh, we know that you, know, you, you had the mouthpiece, but did you have any other roles in ECW besides the mouthpiece? Sure. Uh, when I started out, I was a ring announcer uh, and a timekeeper. Uh, from there, I became a foreign language ring announcer. I did Spanish, Japanese. Uh, then I became a heel ring announcer, so more, like you say, being a mouthpiece. Uh, and that had me basically become one of two managers for the Dudley Boys. Uh, I managed them for about six out of their eight tag team title runs. Uh, and they left, they went to WWE. We got TV on TNN, and I became the color commentator working alongside Joey Styles, so the co-host color commentator. In with that, um, I had some mild kind of post-production roles, so I did some production. Uh, and that's basically the extent of it. Great, and um, a question I had from a fan. He wanted to know who gave you the hardest bump in the ring? Gosh, um, I mean, nothing was ever unprofessional, nothing was ever sloppy, so I never got injured and I was never out of work. So nothing was ever, you know, uh, unmanageable as far as pain or anything like that. So it's a tough question to answer. But I'll say that the most prominent bump that I took was probably total elimination at the first pay-per-view. We were the opening segment and we lost the tag titles. And uh, at the first pay-per-view, I took total elimination from the Eliminators, Perry Saturn sitting right there across the way. And, uh, and when I took that, the reason I, that's so prominent is because that's what put me in the neck brace. Oh, great. And, uh, and yeah, so I definitely, you know, hats off to them. And, and, and that was, you know, it, it looked like murder. But, um, but again, it was, uh, it was amazing. It was great business. Those guys are just impeccable and flawless with the athleticism. So it, it was, you know, you live to fight another day, and it, and it was great. Yeah. And I'll give it to you. I mean, you've had a neck brace for over 20 years. You seem pretty healthy. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, for I come to a convention like this, and I realize I never want the neck to heal. You know, I hope I can be doing this for decades and decades more. Great, great. Uh, we spoke earlier. Um, you're on social media. I know there's a lot of fans out there would love to get to know uh, where they can see you more, what you're doing. Uh, would you uh, tell us how can we see more of uh, Joel Gertner? Sure. Um, I've got a YouTube channel. So if you're on YouTube, please go ahead and look for the Joel Gertner YouTube channel. And the name of it's just my name, Joel Gertner. And I'd really appreciate it if you'd subscribe. Uh, I've got a podcast, The 69-Minute Eargasm. It's available on all of the major podcast platforms. So if you search out 69-Minute Eargasm, you will find it. I've got a second podcast that's going to be ECW-themed called Extreme Championship Wednesday. That's uh, in affiliation with Conrad Thompson, and that's going to be starting in the weeks to come. Um, and then on Twitter, you can find me at Stud Muffin Says, and on Instagram at Quintessential Stud Muffin. And that's eargasm, as in ear. We don't want to take you to a different site. <laughs> um, well, it, I just want to let you know it's been a pleasure talking with you. Um, I hope to see you again. Um, if you could just leave us with one of your famous promos, that'd be great. Total access wrestling, huh? <laughs> Can I get dirty? Always. Well, well, well. It is I, the lyrical miracle, the sexual intellectual, the cunning linguist, and the quintessential stud muffin, rolling with Bob Saunders, where the wrestling access is total. I made your girlfriend yell, and I made your sister 
Yodel. Gertner. Keep listening and have yourself an eargasm. <laughs> that was amazing.